It's a very short talk I'm going to give about uh, educational aspects of uh, what we are going to do with Cash Foundation. Mr. Cash has promised to uh, release in this month, September, information, large information about the technology and uh, the knowledge. So I have uh, now designed a very simple plan how to do it. And that's essential because the transfer of knowledge, yeah, that was promised. <laughs> so we go to the next page now. So tech theoretical knowledge. Mehran has written three books with amazing new concepts. Very logic, very simple. He doesn't he, he doesn't need uncertainty to explain things. The quantum uncertainty is one of the big devils in my eye for science because it, it confirms a certain attitude that we don't know. So we don't know how it happens and so uh, a lot of formulas are made to prove certain things but it's illogic. And um, Mehran Kesh has found a different way to look to reality. And for him, here we see in the first book he explains the concept of the neutron. The neutron uh, who decays in a proton and uh, an electron. He describes the way, the possible logic way, why there is an uncertain path, an irregular path around the atom. Around, uh, around the proton. The electron makes jumps over and because we cannot decide where the electron is, we, we say there is a cloud. The electron cloud, we call it. But there is a reason, there is a logic behind and Mr. Cash has found that logic. It's a beautiful logic. Then we have the structure of light where there is said that light is in fact, it's a plasma. It's a cylindric plasma with internal dynamics. And then we see here the origin of the universe, the third book. And the fir fir fourth book is lying on my desk and I have to read it. And I have to make uh, designs of it, about it. That's not easy at all. But, okay. So the basic, let's say, what is important is that we as Cash Foundation uh, share the knowledge of the, what we understand as being the theoretical concept of the plasmas, sharing it in the world because there is logic and we have real, uh, real results when, when Mehran Kesh heals people or reverses their conditions, re, 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 reduces them in their position and he can do that. That means that the logic he uses to make those medical reactors is correct. Otherwise, he could not do it. So the theoretical knowledge, the transfer of tho those ideas, the processes that he used in his thinking, these are thoughts, that is important. So the basic of his theory is that there is, and that is shared with a number of people, that there is in the cosmos a number of very, very small magnetic rays. And these magnetic rays make a kind of soup. So in fact, energy, in fact, this is, this is energy, is everywhere. And it is to us humans to convert this energy in a way that it fits us. That's important. So like he said, man only converts. You see, so God creates, but man only converts. And then this is a, a beautiful concept where you have the neutron with the fundamental plasma, initial fundamental plasma, who has three elements in it. And it can decay in a proton and in, and re, uh, and in an electron. So this, what is very important in, in sharing the knowledge is, for example, the electron is a plasma. 
Till now, nobody could, could say wh what is pl what is an electron. Nobody knew it. If you ask an electronic engineer, an electrician, what is an electron? I don't know. Now we have a concept, a serious concept for that. So that is information, this kind of information, we have to share it. Because we bring a kind of freedom in the thinking to, to the people worldwide. And it can be a little a little guy in Namibia, <laughs> or it can be whatever, a Japanese. We have to share this information and use the knowledge, the theoretical knowledge that we have, like this, to, to make things, to do something with it for mankind. So for example, so this is the concept. Finally, the decay. Nobody could explain Nobody ever explained what, how the, the, the which steps are in the decay, how the how the neutron becomes a, a proton and an electron. He has done that. So for more than sixty years, the question remains: Why the electron follows an irregular path around the proton? Actual physics doesn't uh, give an explanation at all. But uh, Mehran Kesh has given the answer. Okay, so in fact, what is essential is that we are going to give online access worldwide to information, information theor theoretical course courses and information that is in the three books and in the new books, but also the practical and useful courses which are related to the patents, international patents. We are gi uh, going to give this online in a number of separate segments one, we will have a, uh, a wiki of our own. The problem with a wiki is, of course, that people are going to say, oh, I changed this word, I want to change that word. So we have to, to put a certain limit on it. Then we will have a, a Moodle element. Moodle is an online education system. It's from the United States. What is interesting is that a teacher or someone who wants to give a lecture or whatever, can create his own course there. He can put images inside and people can access it. They can test themselves in that knowledge. So that is existing technology. At this moment there are 27 million people in the world using this system. What is also interesting is that uh, there are modules for about, I think, 30, 40 languages. So the Jew can, can uh, look to this in, in Hebrew. Uh, the Japanese can follow the, 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 the framework. And we want also to use this, so I'm doing tests now. And then we have a module, QuickSmart, where people can test their knowledge. You have a similar system with uh, Moodle, Moodle, but uh, QuickSum is, uh, is, is a, bit, a little bit different. It's not really, it actually it is a question and answering system, but we want to, cha to change it a little bit to make it more open. And then we are also going to create a .NET, probably cache.net or something like that, where we try to, to bring all those people together so they can discuss uh, new things give suggestions, we, we think we, we, this is must be possible with your technology, can we, sh can we discuss this, can we look who takes responsibility, who, who takes, let's say, uh, who will do the design, the software, or whatever. So there we try to make a real community. And so we will, uh, we will have, let's say, in the, uh, the Moodle concept segment, uh, patents, space, energy, health, water, agro, nano, environmental, and new materials. So that way, it is like our Cash Foundation independently helps the education and sharing knowledge for the better of mankind. And that's our target. Okay, thank you all. <laughs>